Tesla's new cells are now with more power, delivering around six times the power and five times the energy capacity of their earlier Tesla 21700 cell. The 4680 is a new cell with a significantly larger size factor and a tabless design. Hey everyone and welcome to Tesla News, where we bring you the newest and best updates about Tesla and Elon Musk. For daily videos, please consider subscribing to our channel. The 4680 battery is a Lion battery with a cylindrical size of 46 mm by 80 mm, diameter times height. The height and diameter are both greater when compared to the 21700 size and 18650 type cells. It is on its approach to replacing the 21700 battery that Tesla electronic cars currently utilize. Because of its higher degree of capabilities, such as charge cycle and higher energy density, the 4680 battery type would be useful in rechargeable and high current draining devices. The voltage, capacity, charge discharge cycle, output current, output voltage, and other features of the 4680 battery are included in the specifications. Only attributes highlighted with the phrase standard are common in all 4680 Lion batteries. The others are not. Other characteristics such as capacity or MAH and charge discharge cycle are also dependent on the manufacturer's technologies. The entire volume of this cell has expanded as a result of the increased length and diameter, and it is stated that this breakthrough would result in a five times increase in capacity and six times increase in power. Tesla's cost per kilowatt hour is predicted to improve by 56% compared to the previous battery pack. Last month, the Model Y had a strong showing in China. After all, Tesla's China plan is to focus substantially on exports in the first half of each quarter. As a result, domestic Model Y sales in China were substantially suppressed in January. Despite this, the automobile is the country's best-selling high-end SUV. Tesla China's wholesale stats for January 2022 reached 59,845 vehicles, a 286.5% rise year over year, according to data from the China Passenger Car Association. From this total, 40,499 automobiles were shipped to other countries, while 19,346 were sold to the United States. The Model Y appears to be gaining popularity in the local car sector, since it accounted for 16,496 of Tesla's domestic sales last year. Despite the fact that Tesla China's vehicle production output is now increasing at a quick rate, the business plans to accelerate its growth even more in the next years. Tesla CFO Zachary Kirkhorn stated at a company's Q4 and full-year 2021 earnings call that the company's objective of achieving 50% year-over-year growth should be doable with just the Fremont factory and Giga Shanghai. Tesla in China, the Tesla Model 3 and Model Y have been recalled due to the suspended heat pump defect that could result in reduced windshield defrost capability. A total of 26,047 Chinese-made Model 3 and Model Y vehicles are affected by the recall. According to a statement from China's State Administration for Market Regulation, the heat pump recall covers a total of 12,003 Model 3s and 14,044 Model Ys, or SAMR. Vehicles implicated by the potential issue were manufactured between December 28, 2020 and January 15, 2022. The heat pump issue for the Model 3 and Model Y will be resolved by an over-the-air software update, similar to how Tesla addressed the issue in the US and Canada. However, ASMR cautioned Tesla owners who are affected by the recall to drive with great caution while waiting for the heat pump to be repaired. Tesla China will also notify owners affected by the problem by registered mail, email, and other methods. Tesla owners in China can also phone the company's China hotline for updates on the recall. The Model Y production vehicle is waiting to be shipped next to the factory demonstrates Tesla Giga Texas's impatience. The Model Y automobiles are entirely hidden, as though they are being prepared for delivery. According to photographs released by drone operator Jeff Roberts, Tesla Giga Texas has over 100 Model Y production vehicles parked on site. The majority of the cars are hidden, but a few are visible. Based on unknown automobiles, Giga Texas is building blue and black Model Y production cars. Tesla revealed on its most recent earnings call that construction of the Giga Texas and Berlin models would begin in the fourth quarter of 2021. Tesla CEO Elon Musk stated that Austin-built Model Y vehicles are equipped with structural battery packs and 4680 cells during his introductory remarks. Giga Texas Model Ys will be delivered once the vehicle has received final certification. The development of Tesla's 4680 battery has been long and difficult, so seeing Model Y vehicles with batteries is exciting for people who have been following its progress. During Battery Day in September 2020, Tesla revealed the 4680 battery. By the second quarter of 2021, Tesla has admitted that its Cattle Road 4680 pilot plant was having difficulties transitioning from small-scale to large-scale production. Right now, we have a challenge with basically what's called calendaring, or basically squashing the cathode material to a particular height. 
Musk said at the time. With the 4680 cell production, Tesla appeared to have surmounted most of the obstacles. According to a Tesla inventor, the production yield of the 4680 cells had increased to around 70% to 80% by August 2021, indicating that the firm was making headway in resolving its calendaring issue. According to more recent sources, the output yield of 4680 cells has substantially improved since then. The Model Y performance is expected to arrive in April 2022, according to Tesla's online order page. The developments of Tesla's 4680 battery have been long and difficult, so seeing Model Y vehicles with batteries is exciting for people who have been following its progress. During Battery Day in September 2020, Tesla revealed the 4680 battery. By the second quarter of 2021, Tesla has admitted that its Cattle Road 4680 pilot plan was having difficulties transitioning from small-scale to large-scale production. According to Drew Baglio, Tesla intends to start delivering the Made in Texas Model Y by end of the first quarter. The lithium metal company's new AU-473 million, or $338 million, Kathleen Valley Lithium Project in Western Australia will provide Tesla with lithium sputamine concentrate. The purchase price of lithium will be determined using the formula based on the market price of lithium hydroxide monohydrate. The Tesla Liontown deal is predicated on the Australian company's Kathleen Valium Lithium Project starting commercial production. By 2025, Liontown hopes to be producing commercially by May 30, 2022. Tesla and Liontown will have completed negotiations and signed a detailed binding agreement. The lithium supply agreement will be cancelled if the two parties do not finish their negotiations. LG Energy Solution is also a Liontown partner. The mining business congratulated LG on its initial public offering earlier this month. Liontown inked a lithium supply arrangement with LG Energy Solutions, according to Reuters. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, recently emphasized this in reaction to President Biden's tweets about electric cars. According to Biden's recent article, the U.S. government is planning to convert all 600,000 federal government vehicles to electric vehicles. According to the president, such an approach will bring more manufacturing jobs back to America while also strengthening local supply chains. Musk was harshly critical of Tesla's Model X refresh ramp earlier this week, suggesting the business should have approached the issue differently. Tesla CEO Elon Musk noted that halting production of the Model X was an unfortunate choice because demand for the vehicle remained strong. Tesla intends to redesign both the Model X and the Model S, the company's two flagship vehicles. Both cars were phased out of production in late 2020, and Tesla revealed new body variants in early 2021. In June of last year, the Model S was delivered to customers for the first time, and in October, the Model X was delivered to customers for the first time. Many customers, however, claimed that their expected delivery dates had been pushed out to late 2021 or early 2022. Tesla has pushed out Model X delivery dates to July 2022, according to several Model X customers. Tesla recently opted to remove various Model X Plaid interior seating options, leaving only a six-seat configuration as a viable option. The main rationale in the decision, according to sources, is that Plaid orders seem to have the six-seat option the most commonly. Thus, Tesla is streamlining manufacturer to speed up deliveries. So this was all. Add your thoughts in the comments section below. Hit the bell icon and also like, subscribe, and share our channel, and stay tuned with us till our next video. We will see you soon with our next video, so be with us and go watch our Tesla Model X video on your left to see some positive aspects about it as well. Or you can also watch newly updated Tesla Model 3 2022 on your right and learn more about the Tesla world. Thank you so much for watching.